Servos Travel Dudes. In this video, we're going to be exploring St. Johan in Tyrol. worth taking a stroll through St. Johan village because you'll find a number of these really pretty mural decorations on all of the windows and the town itself is gorgeous. just stopped at Cafe Reiner. Uh, I'm pretty excited because we have two cakes in front of me right now. This one's called a Zaha Torta and a typical Austrian apple strudel. Now both the cakes are homemade right here and we just found out that this place is nearly a hundred years old and it's open seven days a week. Come to Huber Brewery, uh, and now I'm going to meet with Hannes, who's the brewmaster. We're going to have a little tour around the brewery, learn about the beer. My favourite part then will be to taste the beer. So, hello, nice to meet you. Nice so, to meet you too. Tell me a bit about the brewery. Yes, we are here in Sankt Johann. Uh, we are here in the brew house of the brewery, and uh, the brewery established in 1727 and uh, here we start to produce our beer. And you decided to study this because? I love beer, it's a natural product yeah. and uh, everybody drinks beer. Especially me. <laughs> I hope so. <laughs> <laughs> See the big smile on my face? He says we're gonna go to the storage tanks and have a fresh Uber beer. Before you, you drink a beer, you look like, it, like, like it's color, yeah. like a, is it clear? Is it, uh, is it like a, a, a Natur drüber beer? Uh -huh. uh, and then you smell. That's unfiltered, so it's, it's, not, it's not clear. Yeah, okay. There are uh, Hefe, uh, yeast is inside the beer, uh, so they go on the same, uh, the, the proteins are in this beer, and uh, it's the best beer for a brewmaster. Prefer this? Yes, the absolutely, the because yeah, the, yeah. There are the, the whole ingredients of, of vitamin B or ah, okay. is, not, uh, is inside, right. actually. And the filter process takes out the Takes process. out this, yeah, yes. Yeah, okay. So, cheers. Bro. cheers. Very good. It's good. Yeah, my approval. <laughs> it's delicious. Cheers. Cheers. And of course, St. Johan in Tyrol has some amazing skiing. It's known as small and beautiful.
Bora, 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 We've stopped halfway down the mountain, uh, the mid station of the gondola at this fantastic hotel and restaurant, and I'm with Anne Marie. And you're gonna have to help me pronounce the name of this place. Angara Alm. Angara Alm. Yes, that's We're at Angara Alm. Alm. Um, and what can you tell me? Well, uh, it is a very old place. It's a grown place, so it's 250 years old. Mm -hmm. And it was a farmhouse. It used to be one of the highest situated farmhouses in Kitzbühel Alpen. Yep. And then it turned into an alpage and now since 100 years, pretty 100 years, it's a place where people uh, pop in for having good food and something nice to drink. And most of the food, it's local? Yes, uh, we try. Well, we just tried some actually. Uh, we, we, we're doing this after the food. It was amazing. So hats like off to you and the chef. It was really, really great. We're actually waiting for a glass of wine. It's coming <laughs> in a moment. And I'm looking forward to tasting it. We've had a quick look at the wine cellar, but tell me about the history of that. Well, it is I'm a sommelier, and of course this is that so more and more wines mm -hmm. go into the cellar. And uh, I am a sommelier which is not stuck in a region, which is not stuck in a, in a style. So you find the whole world here, back to 1795. So what are we drinking? What's this one? So this is Blaufränkisch. The one is coming from Schalman, you know, the emperor, Karl the Große, mm -hmm. Schalman. And uh, because he was dividing the grape varieties into Hoynish, which means not so good ones, and the Frankish, Franconian ones. Right. And so he, dis he said this grape variety is one of the noble ones, one of these noblest ones, Blaufränkisch. So this That's is... That's a cool history behind the wine. Yeah. Leave it there and say cheers. Thank you, Anne-Marie. Cheers, thank, thank you. you for, thank you for taking me on a lovely tour, lovely lunch here as well. Thank you very much and enjoy. Yeah, cheers, thank you. We've been recommended this restaurant called Yak Schlossel. Now the head chef is actually a hunter himself and apparently prepares all of the game and all of the meat right inside. Now it's cold, so let's go eat. It's a glorious morning in St. Johann in Tyrol, so we're going to go snowshoeing up to a viewpoint and check out Wilder Kaiser, which means Wild Emperor in English. This is what being in the mountains is all about views like that. St. Johan is very popular for cross-country skiing and I'm with Gunther. He's gonna give me a lesson. He's gonna show me how to do it. I never did it before. Are you confident in me? Yeah. Yeah, we can do it. And we're gonna do some biathlon as well, yeah? Biathlon. Yeah, looking forward to it. Yes. Can't wait, let's go. We finished cross-country skiing and biathlon and the shooting, that was great fun but it's tough when your body, your blood is pumping and you have the energy and the adrenaline. But I think I did okay and we had a great lesson with Gunther. Tonight we're going to eat at Penzinghof which is an award-winning restaurant and in the past it was a farm and actually it's developed into this huge hotel with an amazing infinity pool and I'm really looking forward to tasting this food. 